Okay guys, as you can see, this is the crash site of the uh, where in where Kobe Bryant with the other um, passengers of the helicopter. This is the crash site here in Calabasas, California. As you can see, look at the debris. Look at the debris, the damage. And if you could, maybe if you're in the helicopter, would ever how could you could imagine the damage that it caused in that field so um, it would be impossible to survive it would be a miracle if you could survive but um, yeah I said I said um, all of them uh, just um, they wasn't they weren't able to survive and you know unfortunately one of uh, NBA, NBA legend Kobe Bryant is there in that uh, accident so it's so unbelievable right now we could um, uh, we could we could not uh, imagine um, how uh, the world of NBA um, is grieving right now so see those debris it's really um it's really it has a wide damage in the area and most of the parts of the helicopters are, it's like being pulverized or like that bitten to pieces so um one of the one of the uh one of the uh, residents in that area in Calabasas, California, heard uh, the sound of the helicopter, and uh, it was it was very it's like a jet and going and going across the air. Then boom! Then suddenly, after minutes, he heard um, sirens of the ambulance and the fire trucks. So. He said that it doesn't really happen if it's just a car crash. So it doesn't happen like that if it's just a car crash. It's something big. So uh, now, um, by the, uh, the helicopter of Kobe, it, it was a helicopter with Kobe Ryan in it. We have a big, our, our big star there. And yes uh so sad that um at the age of 41 he passes away and right now he's in the hand of our maker